but yeah, I, I think we all know what happened. We've we've all seen that video, that internet historian video. No, no, it was down the rabbit hole. My bad. Some more channels in my defense. Enjoy not hitting me. Ah, oh, crouch jumping's not a thing. I say it. Fucking hell. I always forget how s fucking blah, 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 they, they are. They give the guys with machine guns the spastic freaking run at you AI, and that's actually kind of pressure inducing, which I'm sure is what it's supposed to do. I need quick damage. That's a funny rag doll. Ready to take it. Which, from what I understand in Russia, that's still not okay. So. I don't pretend to know nothing about all that. You guys can like whatever you want. my opinion, when it comes to judgment, you don't judge me, I don't judge you. Because I kind of have an insult comics like view of things. If something doesn't piss me off, I'm not gonna be mad about it. Oh, it's you. Fuck off, Shrek. Anyway. Like, I don't have a problem with, like, things like that. I don't have a problem with the things that are currently socially being talked about. But, if you insult me, I will talk like I do. You get me started, I will find every which way to insult you, even if it goes against my beliefs, because you hurt me. I'm gonna hurt the fuck out of you, motherfucker. Again, like, I respect people that, like, protest peacefully and spend a lot of time trying to figure out how to get their points across without, like, insulting anyone. Because that takes a lot of ingenuity and heart. But the minute you start screaming about, like... How, you know what, I, I'm just simply not nuanced enough to really talk about this subject. My point is, if you're respectful, I'm respectful. If you're not, I will ruin you.
because in my opinion the only true way to get through to someone is to treat them like a person. Because really you have no idea what they've been through and if they are even used to being treated like a person. Something to always consider when you're trying to make a point. I wasn't in the debate team when I was in high school, but that's only because there wasn't one. My high school didn't have fucking shit. The best thing my high school served for lunch was sweet and sour chicken, and they only did that twice the entire time I was there. It was really cool too, they like came in these little takeout boxes. I'd go so far as to say it was cute, you know? Because that, at that point in my life, that was the first time I actually had a paper takeout box. And I found it really novel at the time. But yeah, back onto the subject of the game. This game has a freaking thick atmosphere. It kind of reminds me of Resident Evil 4 if it was informed by um, Half-Life 2. Anyone else getting that vibe? Anyone else? Well, that's a point of no return. I could tell because that incline was just slightly too high for me to jump normally. Fuck your auto saves. Yo, know, this pandemic has me so fucked up because I straight up thought this guy was wearing a mask. Like, I saw that little bit of white on his, like, upper lip, and I didn't think mustache, I thought medical mask. Alright, always explore to the left first. Nothing over here. Fuck! You know what? I'm loading that save. That was the perfect time for a Molotov and I freaking lagged on it. Seven is the Molotov button. Kinda weird actually, but okay. Perfect. Wait, am I full on ammo on that bitch? Oh, well that will not do. That surprised me. Anything of note down here? A dead end to spawn that dog. The poopy. Took much more ammo than I think it should have, but whatevs. Huh. 
All right, so we got cloudy gray skies, uh, another mill, a green building. Yeah, this, um, what are the games going to wrap up soon? This is actually starting to feel a little samey, and I'm wondering if, I'm hoping this game doesn't overstay its welcome, but it might. And again, for all I know, I'm on the final stretch. But again, it might throw me for a loop by introducing something new again. I'm going this way. Okay. Just had a bad feeling is all. It's obscenely quiet. Fuck you, Farmer Jam. Oh, I thought for sure that was going to be fall damage. I... Which... What's that? Oh, nail gun. Ooh. An actual secret this time. A secret cache of... Mega ammo. Still say that's a weird fucking amount of ammo. 71? Not my place to judge, though. God, I hate those things. You don't move quick enough to really do anything about them. Pardon me? How'd my health get so low so fast? I'm so excited. I'm gonna just switch to the assault rifle. <clears throat> The number six key, I believe. Oh, yeah. Like a communist Tommy gun. Let's see if he behaves the same way again. Well, he threw something. Fuck! Alright. Okay, that time it was fall damage. Cool. Alright. This time I'm going to save right here. So that I can deal with whatever bullshit gets thrown at me. Wait, what? Oh, right. Nail gun. 